MCN will be grabbing a full first ride on Yamaha's rather foxy new limited edition XSR 900 CAF Z9 racer today. With an identical chassis setup as the hugely popular standard XSR 900 street bike, Yamaha claims the new CAF Z9 racer comes with the same agility, stability and feedback chops as the base model which itself featured much improved suspension performance over the original MT-09. The new 900 also uses exactly the same 847cc, 115bhp, traction controlled inline triple as the standard XSR, which should mean spot on fueling and a gloriously loopy power delivery that makes you grin every time you hit the loud button. But what sets the limited edition XSR 900 apart from the standard model is it's the first Yamaha. Built in conjunction with high performance sports car tuners Abart, who also sponsor Yamaha's Modip team. The collaboration plucks a few choice items from Yamaha's XSR accessories catalog and mixes them with some lightweight, bespoke parts. These include U2022 Distinctive CAF Z9 Racing Carbon Fiber Front Nose Cone U2022 U2018 Swallow CAF Z9 Racer Clip-Ons For that genuine U2018 Hands by the Front Wheel Spindle CAF Z9 Racer Riding Position U2022 XA0 Carbon Fiber Seat Cowl U2022 Carbon Fiber Front Mudguard U2022 Sporty Style Tail Light and Tail Tidy U2022 Solo Sports Seat With Suede Cover and Red Stitching U2022 XA0 Acropovi U010D Titanium Exhaust U2022 Numbered Limited Edition Aluminium Plaque U2022 Special Gray and Red Paint Scheme with Abart Logos on the Fuel Tank Front Mud Guard and Seat Cowl Yamaha Say XSR 900 Abart production is limited to 695 bikes worldwide with only 100 or so bound For the UK, Yamaha also claimed this will be the final number of bikes built in the Abart configuration with 40 bikes already pre-sold at XA39999. The remaining 60 machines probably won't be around for long. The base model XSR900 is XA38299. Keep your eyes online with MCN later today to find out whether Yamaha's XSR900 Abart is an investment worth making or a in a frock. XA0